This is a real-time installation of Eagle Claw, the only multi-point tension fastener that grips the floor of your car stronger and installs much easier and faster than any other car mat clips. First, we need to make sure there is sufficient padding or space underneath the carpet at the place of anchor installation before making holes in the mats. To do this, knock on different spots with the hammer, its handle, or another hard object. If the sound is hollow and the floor flexes a little like this, it'll work. If the sound is solid like this, the anchor can't be installed here because the spikes will break. If your car mat doesn't have holes or pre-installed grommets, turn the mat upside down and using the hole cutter, make two holes in the back corners of the mat, each about two inches from both edges or where the anchors will meet the flat portion of the floor that has sufficient padding. Remove one of the nibs if the mat has them to make room for the sliding washer. If you want to, you can use a hammer and wood block. You don't have to make new holes if your car mat already has pre-installed grommets. Now put the cap through the hole in the mat and push the sliding washer chamfered side up past the threaded portion of the cap post. Screw the cap into the anchor until the end of the cap post is even with the bottom of the anchor. Now do the same thing on the other corner. If the sliding washer doesn't go past the unthreaded portion of the post, don't worry. We'll show you what to do later. Make sure that the car floor is flat and dry for proper anchor installation. Where applicable, move the seat back and tilt the steering wheel up. Place the car mat where you want it to stay. While seated, center your heel over the cap and stomp down on it several times as vertically as possible with enough force for the anchor spikes to penetrate the carpet. Don't step on or hit the cap on an angle to avoid breaking the anchor spikes. Now, screw the caps into the anchors until they're tight and the sliding washers snap into the unthreaded portion of the cap posts. To tighten the cap or remove the mats for cleaning, use your fingers, coin, flat screwdriver, or 7 8 inch socket. Now let's test it. Let's check what happened. Well, nothing. The anchors didn't move a bit. If necessary, to make sure all the spikes are fully inserted, you can step or push down on them. As you can see, there's no need to cut the carpet or use any special tools for the Eagle Claw anchor installation. All you have to do is step on it. By the way, there will be no visible holes in the carpet if you have to remove the anchor. Fasten all your car mats with Eagle Claw and have one less thing to worry about.